Hey everyone, what's up? It's a girl Amanda and today as you can tell by the title, I'm doing a long and awaited video that a lot of you have been asking me about, a lot of you have been mentioning to me about, and that is my back wall. I honestly don't know why it is such a statement piece to a lot of people, but first I'm going to answer a few questions about it and then we will go to the wall and I will showcase you guys every bits and pieces of it. So let's get started. <laughs> So the first question is, did I draw these pictures? I in fact did draw these pictures. I don't have any pictures of me drawing them uh, or any videos of me drawing these pictures, but yes, I did draw these pictures um, with hand, start out with the pencil, ended up with a Sharpie to outline and yeah. Um, I don't know why that's so hard for people to imagine, but usually people who are good at music and stuff like that, they are good in art um which i know it sounds weird but arts and sciences go together for a reason i was in arts and science major in college so art and science is just something and you know art it comes in all forms whether it's with music or drawing so i had the best of both worlds with music and with art so yes i did in fact draw those pictures so the next question is how many canvases do i have I have honestly over 30 characters that I have drawn. Um, I haven't really put up all of them because I didn't want my canvas wall to be too too big but then I'm stuck between wanting it to be with a bunch of Disney movies. The next question I always get is what made me choose the characters I have? To be honest the reason why I have who I have on my wall is just simply because those are the movies that I saw that were Disney movies as well as other stuffed animals that I have of Disney movies that I've seen, as well as Disney lounge flies that I also have seen of the movies. So I have anywhere from Pixar to the traditional Disney movies. Um, a lot of times if there are movies that I have seen that's not on my back wall, I have it in a plush toy, or if I don't have it in a plush toy, I have it in a lounge fly. So I have a lot of Disney movies in my room. Honestly, I would probably say there are like over 60 Disney movies represented in my room. I know it doesn't seem like it, but trust me, there is anywhere from Beauty and the Bees to Disney TV shows like The Proud Family, Kim Possible. Um, I have the older Disney movies like Snow White, um, Fantasia, Jungle Book that are from like the 1990s. And then you have the most recent movies. So I have um, Encanto represented in here with the Disney Lounge Fly. I have Up, I have Monsters Inc, Monsters University, an extremely goofy movie, um, pretty much any anyone, Princess Tiana, Maleficent, Tinkerbell, Slinky from Toy Story. So I have a lot of Disney movies represented in my room, like I said. But yeah, I pretty much love anything Disney. So that's why I decided to do this canvas wall. Another question I get is where did I find all of these canvases? To be honest, you can go on amazon.com or go on the app or you can go to Michael's, um, pretty much any store like Walmart, Joanne Fabrics, they will have canvases for you. Now I will say I found it a lot cheaper to get these canvases off of Amazon. Um, I can link that uh, where I got it from exactly, like the exact ones down below in the description box below. I'm not really sure the price difference it is now compared to Joanne Fabrics and Walmart and Michaels, but I purchased all of my canvases off of Amazon. Um, I want to say they're just like an 8x10 maybe, the size, and then the one in the middle is a little bit bigger of course. I got that one from Walmart. But again, I got these canvases off of Amazon. I can link, uh, link that in the description box down below for you guys. But yeah, so if you guys want me to demonstrate uh, a character, I can. I really haven't like thought about adding anyone to my wall. But to keep you all from waiting, here is a close up view of my canvas wall. Um, like I said, these are a lot of movies that I enjoy watching and have watched plenty of times. Um, I really love the storylines where I love the characters. I love the 
personalities that they possess and I just figured that why not put it on my wall. You will see also in the middle of the canvas I have like the Walt Disney logo if you will say. That's usually the beginning part of most of the Disney films. So you have Steamboat Mickey um, steering the boat, whistling. So I figured that was kind of like the, it should have been the center of all of the canvases as though it's like coming out at you with all these different movies that, you know, Disney puts out there or some of the movies rather that Disney puts out there. But yeah, I figured why not put him in the center? It has the Walt Disney Studio Animation Studios logo. So I really wanted to implement that as well. And honestly, I wanted to go with a sketch look at first on my canvases, but then I was like, I'll just leave them all in black and white because they kind of do represent like a sketch look on my wall, especially when you have everything else in my room in color. So why not just leave them black and white? So if there's any character that maybe you like or maybe your loved one likes, or if you think you should draw them all, just drop it in the comments down below. And I will give that a good thought because I have no more canvases. So I would have to go out and buy some more canvases. Um, but I will say I do have a gigantic canvas that is probably the size of all of these canvases put together that I really wanted to do like a mural of just different Disney characters. So again, that's going to be difficult because I don't want to repeat any other Disney character that I have. So although, you know, Lion King may not be on that wall, but I do have it in a lounge fly and I also have it in the plush toy. So me like finding other characters that I don't have is going to be a little tricky. But again, here's another close up of that wall. You guys can save it, screenshot it, do whatever. Hit me up with any other characters that you think I should draw. And I will possibly do that for you guys in another video. But that is another video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.